Hello and welcome to another episode of Mason Outdoors. Today we're going to show you a bunch of footage from the Revolution Micro 50 Pro AquaView camera. And this here footage is within the first seconds of dropping down the camera. We just got the camera down, turned it on, and this bass is right down below us. So great little camera for showing what's going on below the ice and what's happening even if you're boating. So this was our first day. This is actually a sunfish checking out our minnow on the tip up. This is our first day using this camera. We just got it. And you can look in the lower right hand corner of your screen and you'll see throughout the day the time lapse. But absolutely amazing. I mean here you'll see there's two, three bass on the screen at one time. Not a one comes and checks out the minnow. It was just absolutely amazing uh, to see this in action. So if you watched our last video, we were ice fishing with tip-ups. And this minnow is three and a half to four feet away from the camera. We're fishing with rainbows, shiners, and sucker minnows. and But just really cool to see these fish coming in and out of here. And some of them don't even check out the minnow. This one here, he comes in uh, with his partner there. It's actually a pretty good size too, but... This bass is actually 19 and a half inches long, this largemouth, to give you an idea how big some of these are. But absolutely incredible to watch these guys. This one here, he'll come up and he'll hit it here and he actually comes right at the camera. So you'll get to see a nice close-up of him coming in. This one here, if you look at the time lapse, this fish comes in within minutes. Uh, I mean, within 30 seconds of putting that minnow down. That minnow just got down. He comes in and hits it. Kind of interesting to see how this all goes down. Now he drops it. His buddy comes in and takes it. Second one. Spits it out. Third bass comes along and hits it. He drops it. Fourth one hits it, spits it out. He kind of, fifth one plays with it a little bit there. And then you can see us coming over to get the tip up. And absolutely nothing. There we're pulling it up. Now we have panfish coming in by the bundles. And then Mr. Bassey comes in and says, that's mine. Over the course of the day, we caught six largemouth bass over 18 inches and countless 17, 16 to 18, just under 18 inches. But 
six of them were over 18 inches and you see the size of some of these bass at 16, 17, 18 inches and even 19, 19 and a half and we got a crappie that's coming up here that we're just curious to see how big that thing actually is. The sunfish has got to be pretty decent there too. And now this crappie, comment down below on how big you think that crappie is. We're just curious to have an idea of how big you think that one is. We ended up catching one that was 13 and a quarter but didn't have much of a tail. Look at all the bass. There is just countless bass. There's bass swimming by for about three to four minutes. All oh, just beautiful, healthy fish. You'll see the sunfish here, they just showed up if you're watching the timestamp. They hang around for almost an hour.
The last ones are just taken off, and now you'll see why Mr. Bass comes rolling in. This is quite an amazing school of bass, all largemouth bass. Thanks for coming along with Mason Outdoors today. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like and subscribe button so you can stay up to date on many more videos and adventures to come.